Hi, welcome to Artificial Neural Network session. The Artificial Neural Network imitates the behavior of human brain. Neural Network which allows computer programs to recognize the patterns of environment or objects and solve the problems in artificial intelligence, machine learning and deep learning domains. The artificial neural network is having connection of nodes which are formed in the uh, format of layers. The layers are again uh, segregated into the input layer and hidden layers. The hidden layers may be one hidden layer or two hidden layers and finally output layer. So each neural network is having three types of layers. Each layer is having n number of neurons which is defined by the user, the input layer and hidden layers and the third one is output layer. The artificial neural, net, ne, artificial neuron is constructed by creating artificial neurons on your computer which is connecting many artificial neurons that creates the network. So each network is having set of neurons which are connected each other. The artificial neuron works like a neuron which is present in the human brain. The data in the network flows through each neuron by established connections. Every connection is having specific weight by which control the flow of data in the neurons. If output of any individual neuron is greater than specified threshold value then that neuron node is activated. If it is activated that pass the data to the next layer, next layer of the neural network. Otherwise if it, that value is less than the threshold value then this neuron is not activated and also the data will not pass into the next layer. The biological neuron is indicated in this uh, slide. So the human brain is containing of set of neurons or nerve cells which is transmitting and process the information which is received from our senses like ear, nose, eyes, skin, etc. Many such nerves, nerve cells are arranged together in the brain to form a network of nerves. So here each nerve pass the electrical impulses when the excitation occurred from one neuron to another. So the neuron is indicated in this figure. So here uh, this is called dendrite branch. So each one is called, these portions are called dendrites and this inner, inner side that uh, face like structure is called nucleus. Then uh, this, this portion is called shoma this portion is called soma and the edge this edges are called snaps edges are called snaps edges are called snaps and this portion is called axon this portion is called axon then this end but end of the end, the end of the axon is called terminal buttons terminal buttons so when the dendrites are receiving the impulse from the terminal buttons so these are the terminal buttons these are the terminal buttons which are connected to next neuron available here the neuron structure is looking like this so uh, the impulse is received by the dendrites through the terminal buttons here also for each neuron we will have the terminal buttons here also we will have the new uh, terminal buttons the terminal buttons receives the impulses then which is uh, receiving uh, as a input to the input from the adjoint neuron the dendrites carry the impulse 
to the nucleus of the nerve cells the nucleus of nerve cells is called soma that is what given here so this dendrites the dendrites are carrying the information into the soma right so here dendrites are there which is carrying the information to the soma then the electrical impulse is processed by the nucleus then it is passing on to the action as a output so here this is the action the it the processed information will be sent to the axon to pass into the next neuron the axon is the longer branch longer branch which is uh, connecting the uh, two neurons two neurons by carrying the impulse from dendrites to the soma which is called snaps which is called snaps the snaps then passes the impulse to the dendrites of the second neuron the so the complex network of neurons is created in the human brain in this given pattern so based upon this artificial neural network is created this is the human brain the human brain is having n number of neuron neurons the neurons are connected with uh, connected with the network so which is called neuron neural network so here this is given the image of each neuron as we have discussed dendrites are mentioned here which is carrying the information from another neuron and cell body that is called this is the cell body and the nucleus is given here then here the nucleus is called soma here soma is uh, uh, carrying the information uh, from uh, nucleus to the dendrites then dendrites uh, pass the information into the axon the axon is connected to axon is the longer uh, branch the longer branch is connected to the next neuron here the uh, this structure is given by using the artificial neural network structure so here the axon is this one which is connected to the snaps snaps is available here then signal signal is here uh, which is received which is received as a output here the input is given input is given to the neuron input is given to the neuron this red color is a uh, red color circle is called neuron the input is received from the um, axon right then which is passing into the dendrites so so many dendrites are there so these are all dendrites these are all dendrites so we are having the so many dendrites to pass the input the dendrites are carrying the information into the soma the that is neuron body then inside nucleus will be there the inputs suppose if i am having one here is uh, 1.5 here too so all this data will be processed by the nucleus then output will send in the form of signal through the synapses right through the synapses the this yellow color ed this edges are called synapses so through through this uh, synapses it will send to the axon then axon will carrying into the next neuron so next neuron will be available in this place so this is the neuron structure in uh, in uh, electronics we can uh, represent the neural network in the form of some uh, gates and the transmit trans transceivers so here the dendrites are represented in the form of connections and synapses is the nucleus here in the form of array for to performing the calculations the entire thing is called axons so here neurons will be activated by passing the impulses so this is the structure of artificial neural network based upon the human brain thanks for watching